Day two. Round two. Day, yep, day two, round two. All right. We have the Mass Mutations X. Uh, we're going to play some Keyforge. So, welcome. Yeah. Especially if you, join us, if you didn't join us earlier, we had, uh, we had a little early stream as well. <laughs> uh, I left my phone in the other room. Uh, 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 okay, get my phone. Be back. Woefully unprepared. Well, let's see what we got here. I have Hell Malin, the director of the oppressed. Oh, okay. Okay. We got uh, Sanctum Dis Saurian. I don't know if, we, if I've seen a Sanctum Dis Saurian side yet. That might be a new um, combination for me. I've got the Aya of Mungavard. Hmm. Uh, it's got Niffle Kong in it. Oh, hell. Okay. And a Day of Silas. Oh. Got what? Him. The double. The double duper. Oh, man. They sell us any Niffle Kong. I got two It's Comings. Oh, man. Oh. That's sweet. Oh. We got a Maverick in this deck. This deck has got it all. Wow. It has a troop call. What? <laughs> it's got an enhanced Niffle Ape. Oh, my God. This deck. Oh, my God. Jeez, dude. We got there. That's uh that's pretty sweet. This, this like this deck if this deck sucks, if this deck is like awful, I will always love this deck. Yeah. Um as if it were a child. <laughs> uh there's this deck can do no wrong as far as I can I I am concerned. That is pretty cool. It's a Maverick Bow Knifing. Okay. When in this. So that's good. That sounds great. Yeah. Yeah. Toss it up there. D. Oh man. What's the rest of that untamed look like? Uh, it's got a Song of the Wild, which is potentially devastating if that's, you attack with a bunch of... Yeah, that's pretty good. It's got two Dino Beasts, which is the five, it's five power skirmish, and then you can play an Exalt and do three. So that's pretty good, too. It's got a low Dawn, so you can shuffle all of the Niffles back into the deck um, if they get board wiped and whatnot, so... What's the Niffle Ape got on? Uh, the Niffle Ape has an Amber. Yep. Okay, so Sounds totally great. fine with that. Yeah. Um... You do have a Siren Horn, which is actually good on Deosilus, because uh, uh, it moves one from the mm. creature onto what it fights, right? Yeah. So, oh, you got an Ancient Power. So, I hope I have a way this, to kill giant creatures in this deck. This deck's looking like a banger. Yeah. Here's the Maverick Bow Knifing, everybody, and he looks sweet. I gotta be honest, it's the the classic yeah. rule of of Maverick. Well, stuff looks cooler when it's looks, Maverick. Yeah. I feel like Dis Mavericks in particular are usually look really good. So yeah, this deck looks like a banger. It's it's like a little light on Amber Control. It's just I don't know. It just looks like there's so much cool stuff going on. And, um, that, your your deck is fifty five sass. That's so says, funny. It says it's fifty five. That's Hilarious. so funny. Mine's sixty one. Sure. Yeah, I don't believe that. I don't believe that for a second. Yeah. There's no way this deck isn't isn't an absolute slapper. <laughs> this deck has to be cool. Sass is zero percent accurate, I feel yeah. like, with the when it comes to this set. There's so much you can't account for. Right. Oh, 171. Okay. I see. I see. All right. Base Eric with 61. A lot of enhanced icons in here. Like this uh, Capture Citizen Strix. I mean, play a dude, get to, uh, you know, answer to Amber. I like Capture icons a lot. Yeah. They're pretty good. Yeah. Uh, I got two Relentless Creepers. Uh, I will complain that none of them got enhanced in this yeah. deck, but I think I think somehow this deck will remain special. I did get a Double Doom enhanced with a Amber Icon on it. That's extra good. So.
break key. I also have a break key. I'll never, I have two break keys. Okay. I'll never forget the game break key. That was the most fun yeah. one week of our lives. <laughs> and when the game break key was popular in our comic book store. Yeah. God, what a what a what a genius game. <laughs> That's genius. What a genius. It was designed game. to make you buy more to even play it. Yeah. Every single time you Every played single it. time you played it was one less time you could play it. Yeah. It was pretty good storm, but uh Nathan just opened this banger. Yeah, an absolute slapper. You're in the middle of marathoning live stream on YouTube. Well, good news, you can pause it. You can watch <laughs> live. And uh yeah. There's all kinds of I mean, this set this set is really deep, I'd say. Yeah. I think Worlds Collide, once you got a handle on it, you you kind of like knew what to expect within, you know, like a like a narrow band, what to expect from each house and how they combined. But this set, on the other hand, it, it's hard to predict. I can imagine going to a Vault Tour and you're like, you'll see someone's deck where you're just like, I didn't even know that was possible. Yeah. What you, the stuff you're doing, I can't even comprehend, yeah. right? Yeah, we did storm. We did stream earlier today. Storm strong. We only played five games on that stream, though. So uh, we just got so much, so much to get through. And this set is—it's really not a chore, no, to get through these decks. Because, like, like I, I was, I willed this deck into existence. Um, you know, like, like wanting, wanting something like this to exist. Um, yeah, that's true. I like. I, I will say, like, the we're learning. We're still learning, like, the plays. That you can make because like, we're taking more time on our turns to like yeah oh man how many i have like all kinds of different stuff i can do in different houses because we haven't quite learned all the cards yet we haven't learned like what to worry about on the opponent yeah. side yet I, I do think the amber total almost we we have learned that it does not matter what your amber total yeah is. Like, it, you cannot get really punished mattered. you will not get punished for it you know yeah um so it does seem like generating the most amber is almost always correct. That was not correct in Worlds Collide, and it was not correct in AOA. Um, AOA, honestly, it was like, get to six. Just yeah. get to six if you can. Um, and in Worlds Collide, uh, you didn't want to go too high because of taxes and stuff like that. And it does seem like there's a decent amount of amber taxing in this set, uh, but nothing to really punish you. Let me ask you guys something. If I put my deck on the right side, along with my keys, is that going to bother you? Kind of is bothers that, me. Is that it bothers you. I used to do this all the time me. in the basement. I don't remember why I switched. I think there was a glare on the discard pile or something, but I don't know if that glare. I don't remember. That's how it used to be on the old bat. Yeah. Oh, I have no idea. We switched it for some reason. I don't know. I think it was a glare reason. Let me see. What, let me see what it looks like for this setup. You can still see that. And I think it gives us more room to play with when they're, we're not so restricted right here. Oh, I gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Because we, we're, we're constantly... Yeah, I gotcha. Okay, I'm gonna do this. Okay, I'm gonna do it. We'll just get used to it, it's fine. Is this better? See, they already love it. Oh, man. This is the first time Chad has ever we've liked lost, change. We've lost control of the stream. <laughs> A two. Okay. We'll go first. Can you be vertical across the bottom? What does that even mean? Like down here? No, uh, I feel like that's like in my way. I like to put stuff there sometimes. Did to avoid the cover of the logo? Uh, I mean, logo's fine. I am actually going to mulligan. So I'm going to show this hand. The reason I'm mulliganing is because I have it's coming and not one of the halves. Yeah. Okay. So I don't know. You don't know what to get with it. Yeah. You would just grab something and then it would butt up your hand. Yeah. You would like get you would get a half of it and then just put it in this card pile or something. Yeah. And that sounds suboptimal. So. Is the half of Niffle Kong that doesn't have the text on it is that still considered a Niffle? You can, you can grab the untamed half. So if Nathan puts his keys like there, then we know exactly where the battle line is too. So this is here. Gives us our, our bounds. Or do you mean like that? 
So that gives us like less room, right? Because then we can't have guys on top of the keys. And we like to keep our ammo in front of the keys, so. I'm, I'm vetoing that one. Yeah, just watch the stream like this. Yeah. Same side. Yeah, but it still gives us less room, right? Because it's like, that's, oh no, that, oh, I hate that. I hate mm, that concept. Yeah, I'm mm. throwing up thinking about no, it. That's terrible. Mm -mm. Big mm -mm. It's down to six. Look, it's fine. Everyone likes change. Okay, that's why you're making the horrible suggestion. Executive veto, yeah. Okay. Big I, oh hell no. <laughs> I will go first. I will say sorry and I will play console primus. And it's your turn. I'll draw. Alright, I'm gonna say dis. I'm gonna play two break keys. Yep, yep. Because those are not gonna get value anytime soon. And a lot of time they they probably very rarely will get value. Play Drecker, play inspect inspector. That'll be good with that card that like taxes with the number of disc creatures in play though. If you like unforge their key and then tax a bunch, that'd be yeah. really good. Yeah. Um, especially if you could unforge both and then hit one on the same turn. It, like, yeah. destroy two keys Jeez. and then make them forge again. That'd be, like, a way to just get you back in the game, rip yeah. you back in the game. Um, I'll say dis. I'll Dance of Doom for four. Um, so Drekker is destroyed. I think, um, I think both have do have traits for, like, the troop call. I play Relentless Creeper, Bow Knithing, and Snarette. I want to say True Pot Call gets both halves of the Niffle Count. Well, go ahead. All right, I'll say Saurian. I'll play the M4 Captura. Oh, nice. Okay. Lots of. Uh... So I can resolve any bonus icon as Capture. Play Galeatops, Shrix. Actually, I have to exalt him. That mm. kind of sucks. I'll play uh, Pterodactyl. I mean, do I even play him now? You can only really play him with Charette. I mean, it's fine. It's fine. I'll just exalt him, I guess. Your turn. Did you draw your card? I did not draw my card. Okay, I'll play the Stair Centurion. I did not see that. All right, your turn. Okay. I am going to say Saurian. I'm going to play It's Coming. Oh, man. I ate a couple of that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Troop Call, if it only got half, would be pretty lame. We need, like, we need a good couple paragraphs on, on giant creatures, I think. I am going to play Beware the Ides and blow up Galatops. All right. I am going to play Deosilus. Down he comes. <laughs> um, deal five to an enemy creature. I will shoot the Imp Spectre before I get before I get caught. I was afraid you were just going to like crash him in there and take out like my half my Deosilus. Oh, um, that would be pretty bad. <laughs> yeah. Break key, get it, it out of here. Uh, he's tapped. Um, yeah, we. And then uh, console primus. I'll reap with console primus to move one from Deosilus to Citizen Tricks. And it's your turn. Untap Deosilus and draw. Okay. I'm going to say Sanctum. Play. Cool work. Play or Golgotha. Okay, I have thing. That is a gray rider. The Golgotha is just oh, like a snaret doesn't have yeah. yeah. Golgotha's just got so much potential right now. 
Deals three to each neighboring creature. I kind of just want to kill Primus. So. Damage icon on Golgoth. Oh, what the heck? I'll do one there. Play Grey Rider. I'll fight the Creeper. Blow that stuff up. Super blow it up. I'll play Ardent Hero and the Bulwark. Just slamming it's a bunch of Sanctum guys. Okay. Okay. I am going to say Untamed. I'm going to play It's Coming. Okay. Mm Niffle Kong right there. I'm gonna just go ahead and play this Niffle Kong. Yep. Get their stuff. Um, so search my deck for any number of Niffle creatures, reveal them, and then put them into my hand. Deck and discard pile. Deck and discard pile. World first double uh yeah. double giant creatures on camera. <laughs> Literally you've not seen this before. Only two niffle apes? Uh the other one was in my hand. Oh, okay. Yeah, Storm. <laughs> uh, I don't know what I hear. Ardent Hero can never die to the Daily Silas or the Nifflecon. <laughs> they're but... mean? Okay. Yeah. Well, he's... they're over five power, too. Oh, yeah. Power, yeah. Fire. He's extremely powerful. I like that guy a lot. I'm just going to have to fight them with a bunch of Sanctum guys, like a bunch of knights. <laughs> just riding. <laughs> Riding in the battle. The Great Rider leading the charge. <laughs> All right. I am going to play this Niffle that gets me a uh, bonus icon when I play it. I'm going to play a Niffle down there. I'll play a Niffle over here. Niffle there, Niffle there. N niffle everywhere. I'll play Low Dawn. It's got um, Low Dawn too. Yeah. Uh, okay. That's it. Uh, that's, your the, turn. that's the most consistent, yeah. Di big giants giant you can have, right? I, yeah. Well, we were, I mean, I got I got lucky because I just kind of like I drew the it's coming with half of it each time, mm -hmm. but still. Hmm. Yes. Yeah. You don't have any. Okay. So I'm gonna say sanctum. I'll play commandeer and I'll resolve that as a capture. Can Can I not gift a sub using my Twitch Prime? No. Oh, I don't, no. I don't think it works that way. You can find some channel, uh, you know, sub to like Mortavis or one of the other uh, streamers. Put that there. Um, okay. What should we do? Uh, no. So it's coming. Says search your deck and discard pile for either half of a gigantic creature. Reveal it and put it into your hand. Shuffle your deck. Um, so that's why I thought the double giant creature decks would be very consistent because. Um, it's like in this case, I could use the untamed one to go get Deosilus. Um, so. Alright, Golgoth is going to fight this Niffle Ape. Okay, so these Niffles die and Niffle Kong takes one. Can I kill this no Probably not. Is it worth putting damage into it? And that day of Silas is just God. <laughs> oh. Okay. So Reap with the hero. Reap with bulwark. Reap with bulwark. I'm going to reap with Grey Rider. Then Mogoth is going to charge into Deosilus. Okay, so three damage to each of them, so you get the hamper back from Sinaret. Yeah, and then I assault two and deal five. five. So seven into Deosilus. Okay. 
these cards look so awesome on the table. They do. I, I was sure. like, I when when they revealed these, I thought that these would look so cool on the table. I'm I'm so glad. All right, I am going to say, um, uh, this. That'll let me get back my relentless creeper. I am going to um, pain reaction the gray rider. So two damage to gray rider. It destroys it. It does two damage to the neighbors. I am going to play Relentless Creeper and implosion it. So it dies. Uh, and then I destroy an enemy creature. I will destroy Theros and Tarion. I will play Bone Saw and. Uh... Oh, is ready. Bone Saw is ready. Um, Bone Saw is going to fight Citizen Shrix. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Um, I got you for three minutes. <laughs> I am gonna double doom. Uh, it is enhanced with an icon. So I will bounce. I'm guessing I'm gonna bounce the pterodactyl. Discard card and random from your hand. Uh, this deck is dumb. It's <laughs> so far. Imagine, imagine playing this in a vault tour. That would be pretty fun. Hey. Hey. I think you actually wanted that one discarded, probably. Probably. Uh, all right, it's your turn. I'll say check with 11 and I'll draw. Think about 11. All right, I'll say. Uh, I'll say dis. Gonna gleeful mayhem. <laughs> so I'll kill Bulwark, I'll kill Bonesaw, I'll do 5 and do 5. Okay, so Nephilim takes 3 and Deosilis takes another 5. Bring the soundboard to the Voltor, yeah. If we ever uh, have Voltor again. Nathan's deck is ranked 55 Sass. <laughs> yeah. Hilariously enough. That Sass is not prepared for double creatures. No. Play a Cinder, play Snoret. Play Grim Reminder, or... I think Saurian. Sanctum gets me... Grey Rider Golgotha back though. And Deosilis is at 12. Not dead to anything. <laughs> yeah. yeah, Golgotha could attack him for another 7 and he'd <laughs> still be alive at 1. Yeah. Starring gets me Theros Tree and Citizen Trix Pterodactyl and Galatops though, so that's probably good. I'm gonna take that. That's a good card. This is a good card. Um, get a chain and check with six. All right, so I forge. Yep. Uh, Snareat will capture one. So it's four, five, six. Forge the key. Okay, I am going to say Sarian. I'm going to play a Gladio Dantus. He comes in and plays Stunned. He's the one that goes totally sick house. What is the power of creatures in the deck? Uh, this, this, I wish I had a legacy Maverick Might Makes Right, because it's just like, Shh. play Niffle Kong, sack all those Niffles, forge a key, you know? Um, I will play... Uh, this is actually admittedly pretty sweet. I'm going to play Ancient Power. So it gets one, it lets me capture one, and then I ward each friendly creature with an ammo. Man, on. that's super good. Yeah. <laughs> um, I will play Chant of Hubris. So I'll move the one off Deosilis to Cinder, I suppose. I will play Console Primus, who gets to do a damage. Uh, it'll do a damage to Snoret. Do a damage to Snoret? Yeah. 
Um, and then Deosilis is going to fight Cinder. All right, he's dead. Uh, I will lose the ward. Um, I move one from the from him to the common supply, and then I deal two damage to each enemy creature. Now, um, it says cannot be dealt damage by mutant creatures or creatures with power five or higher. Um, I don't think the ability... Is the ability the creature? The creature? I don't think so. Um, does anybody know? It's the same reason like enhancement icons. It is? It is. So he couldn't actually do damage to him? Right. That that was my question. I didn't think it could, at least not though. They just clarified this on Saturday. Okay, okay. Oh, okay, cool. I didn't watch that Crucible sure. test. Okay, that's a good All one. right, so I will say check with seven, and I will untap your turn. I will draw four. Okay, say uh, Saurian, Dark Half. Rock Hurling Giant? Okay, cool. Can't target that guy. Oh, okay. I'll play. We well, could target him, but he can't damage him, right? I mean, play a Strix. Steal one. Play. Strix. Steal one. Play. Pharaoh. Capture. Play Galatops. Play Pterodactyl. Play Siren Horn. Centurion's like, yes, yeah, not probably the target. Yeah, that's a, that's a very good target. Uh, okay, that's it. Snarrat captures one. Check with eight. Okay, I will say Saurians. I'm gonna put a siren horn on my Deosilis. I am going to unstun my Gladiodontus. I am going to play Curse of Vanity. I will exalt a friendly creature and exalt an enemy creature. Um, the upgrade looks measly, yeah. <laughs> I know. guess we'll exalt Therosentarian. Um... I am going to reap with console primus to move one from a one from one creature to another. Move that to the Therocentarian. And then Deosilis is going to go fight the Therocentarian. So the Siren Horn is going to move that onto him. And um, uh, yeah, so I'll take six. Um, Putting him two away from dead, but uh, it'll do two damage to all of your creatures. We're the running out of tokens here. That's not dead. That takes one. one. Uh, Snoret's toast. Snoret's dead. This. Okay. And it is your turn. I will draw two. Check with 12. Yep, I'll forge. <laughs> Is it 20? Or 18? Yeah, two damage kills him. So, okay. bulwark anything kills him. Okay. They sanctum. He's like his damage. The damage he's is done though. Like, you're probably not even gonna say a sorry in the next turn, honestly. And also, you have twelve amber, so there's that. There's that little problem. Um, yeah, that say, say additional something. wrinkle. That little wrinkle. Play a potion. Play work. Play champion. Fight Deosilis. Down it goes. 
the mighty day of Silas falls. After you kill waging unknowable amounts of my creatures. <laughs> after waging an unholy war. Yeah. Every icon may be a capture icon, but I don't have any icons. The yeah, the I potion. Have potion, but I yeah. I'll reap this hero. That's it. Okay. I will forward for six. Yeah, I gotta, gotta get game, gain Amber to win. Not that that's happening. I like you haven't said Dis in 100 years. Uh, I played a lot of Dis at the beginning. Okay. Um, I had that, like, gross. Yeah. Uh, it's honestly... It's either... Dis or Untamed. Sorry, it's either uh, Saurian or Untamed. Tamed. Um, the problem is all my Sanctum guys just barely have text. <laughs> and my cards need two cards to fit all of their text on them, so... I guess I'll say... I guess I'll say Saurian. Um, I can play Citizen Strix, who gets to capture one, so I'll capture on Niffle. Um, I'll exalt and steal. Uh, Gladio Dauntus just gets to go sick house. Um, so Gladio Dauntus is gonna fight this Citizen Strix. So play, uh, so fight Reap. If this is the first time Gladio Dauntus has been used this turn, ready it and enrage it. So now Gladio Dauntus is gonna kill the other Citizen Strix. That guy's pretty good. Yeah, he's awesome. That's how you make a 15 power creature. Yeah. Um, Consul Primus is gonna reap and move one off Shrix onto, I guess, this bulwark. Uh, yeah, sure, that bulwark. And that'll be our turn. And I will say check with nine, I will draw one. Go ahead. Okay. Um, so I have to say this and just like use all my. Icons captured. <laughs> Stop you, so I'll play a Sinistra. Can't play anything on the left flank. Uh, if I play something on the left flank, you lose one. Yeah, yeah. I'll mark of dis to capture two instead of draw, and that's a really good mark of dis. Yeah. Don't get me wrong. Um, I'll shoot the Nipple Kong. Okay, it's got armor. I have to choose Untamed next turn. Mm -hmm. I'll Stirring Grave to uh, archive a creature from my discard pile. Yep. Be the Grey Rider. And I'll Implosion. Sacrifice a creature. Honestly, it's probably just the Sinestro. Not great. Uh, to kill Nifficon. Okay. Um, okay, I'm done. Alright, I will say Untamed. I'm going to play Gloriana's Attendant. Um, I am going to play Dino Beast and Exalt it. And do three damage to that bulwark. Uh, I will play another Dino Beast. I'm not gonna exalt this one because uh, I can't kill anyone. Did you have the troop call yet? Troop call is in the bottom two. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I honestly thought about holding this because uh, that would let me draw the troop call. Mm -hmm. It might be correct to hold this, draw the troop call, and draw not the troop call yeah. without shuffling. So that's what I'll do. I'll hold that and draw the two. That does make sense. Go ahead. Alright, I'll say sorry, Ian. Play Dreadbone Decimus. Oh, that guy's awesome. To kill Shrix. Play Dreadbone Decimus. Kill Shrix. Uh, Primus. Kill Primus, yep. Play Cornison Octavia. 
Well, city state interest. Capture all the stuff. Um, that's done. And Gala Tops. I was gonna. Oh, we got boar. Okay, actually, he'll fight the Dino Beast. Dino Beast. Or that Dino Beast, yeah. He'll take five. Okay. Okay. I am. Did we know if the troop call gets the other half? I would say yes. We I would. Can, we could say so. yes for now. Yeah. Um, we actually find out, but I think yes. Okay. I will say untamed. I'll play troop call. Niffles. Exhum gets both halves. Really? Did they say that? That's crazy. If that's true. Holy crap. Hmm. Because you like, I guess, because you play it, you can only play it with the second half. Yeah, I thought the reason that the exhum wasn't in the set was because of these. But do, um, does the stirring thing or stirring grave would not get both? It only get half. It only get half. But the one that archives everything of a house would get both halves, right? Yeah, I'll play the niffle ape that's got the bonus icon on it. Um, I will play niffle kong. Got all the apes. I'll play some Niffle Apes. I will play Gloriana's Attendant. Uh, Dino Beast is going to kill uh, this Dreadborn Decimus. Choose a creature in your discard pile. Okay, go ahead. Confirmed that tr creature is on both, but traits only on half. Okay. What? Traits are only on half? That, to me, that makes... I guess it kind of makes sense, but... We're, we're playing with traits on both for this game, at least. Yeah. Until we like, figure that out. All right, I'll say Sanctum. Give the archive. Play uh, Techno Knight. Play Harvest Joya. time. Well, the the difference is, is that when the creature is in play, it counts as one card, right? That's the uh, that's the thing is is when the creature is in play, it's only one card. But in any other zone, it's both cards. Now, only one of the cards has the traits on it, right? So, play Bears for Joya. So both my Barrister Joys are enhanced. Yeah. That's pretty insane. I'm going to pop the potion. I'm going to start killing Nipple Apes. Uh, okay, so fight that. Fight that. Fight Dino Beast. Play Grey Rider to fight this Nipple Ape. Yep. Your turn. I am going to say this. I am going to double doom. Uh, we'll get the terror dactyl. And then I'll play Relentless Creeper, Dark Minion, and Drucker. It's your turn. So check what's that. <laughs> I'm sure it'll be clearly explained in the rules update. I hope so. We'll see. Uh, okay. Check what's that. So I'll... You forge. I forge. Okay. Oh, uh, we liking mutations? Pretty good. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Uh, okay, I'll say Saurian. I'll play Pterodactyl. I'll capture two. If 
Oh god, the dark minions put so much damage on my board. I have a lot of armor. Yeah, I'll fight the dark. Then I'll exalt him to kill Drekker. I guess the Drekker dies. Yeah, but I'll exalt him to kill the real Drekker. Okay. And then everything takes one. It's a mutant, I think. It's a mutant. Is it his non mutant? He is oh, he can't do damage to that guy. Yeah, okay. I already got that one. And... Okay. Um, I'll play Forum of Giants as the start of your turn. The player who controls the most powerful creature gains one. No, I won't play that. I thought it was Capture's one. That's just going to be you forever. <laughs> so, and then Glaia Tops will just reap. Okay. All right, my turn. Yeah. I will uh, play Ancient Power. They ruled Exhume can be used to on Explorer to be played as an attachment. Ah, okay. Um, so I'll word my Gladiodontus. I will play Siren Horn on the Niffle Kong. I can put the siren. I'll put the siren horn in the gladiodontus. Because you triggered both harbinger's doom and then the cloak. What? I'm trying to see where your taunt is. Oh, okay. Yeah. I will play. It's coming. Unfortunately, I don't have the other half of Deosilus. I will a uh, chant of hubris. Um, from uh, I guess this bulwark onto Cornice and Octavia. And then I'll fight Octavia twice to kill. It does that? that yeah, it moves over to there. Okay. And that's your turn. I'll say check with 14. I will draw. Okay. 14, huh? Do you have the. I mean, if you have the city state I'm interest. Like city yeah, state. I was like, I mean, it. If you had the city state interest, it didn't matter how much I had because I can't kill enough of your dudes. Um, so, okay, I'll say Sanctum. Play Common Deer to capture one. Play. I'll reap with this Techno Knight. Discard and draw. Now oh, there's the city state interest. All right, okay. that's it. It was literally this dude, I think. That guy? That guy kept me from just killing everything on the table. Yeah. Right? Like, I think I I think I can fight you off the board very effectively uh without that guy on the table. Because he kept he kept shielding key units. Yeah. Um so I had to like go around 
Also, I didn't have this, Dance of Doom. Uh, I played it super early. Had I known how much we would have had in the game then, um, or how long the game would have gone, uh, Dance of Doom would have been really good. So That is awesome, though. Yeah, it's really sweet. I do think I lucked out that you didn't have board wipes. You had a lot of hammer control, but not a lot of board wipes. Yeah. I didn't have like a clean way to kill, uh, besides just fighting, so... The is that the is that the rush deck we got that Nathan opened the thirty one because I think that the deck, thirty amber one at least in that one game it definitely seemed very very strong I don't remember the name of it though exactly it was like the second deck yeah yeah I would I I am excited to get some of these decks for the gauntlet too this deck has five angry mobs in it five angry mobs okay I mean that's something I guess. I, I kind of yeah. liked what those one angry mob that one angry mob deck I had was doing. This deck does not look good though. <laughs> See you around, Archer. Archer. Thanks for stopping by. Definitely glad you could join us for a little bit. <laughs> Thanks again. Thanks for those hundred bits. Cool. It was like thirty expected amber. more sanctum I do feel like we're pretty high on sanctum right now. I don't I mean I don't think it's like unreasonably high is the thing. Okay. I'm not mad at Sanctum Dislogos though conceptually. Please this deck's name. Raw mint Starborough Gurgen is <laughs> What? This is like a 1950s science fiction name. Oh, that's the deck right there? 30 expected amber? Is that right? Yeah, oh, yeah 30.73. I have Campbell, the Lion of the West, <laughs> which is pretty cool. Uh, this is a pretty unimpressive untamed side in this deck. This deck's not looking great. Yeah, two fidgets though. I'm gonna play all your events before you get to. Great. Yeah, Lannister deck. Campbell Lannister. At least have a Ghost Hawk to go for the fidgets. I feel like Ghost Hawk is somehow even better in this set. He was good in the last one, um, yeah. but. Uh, the problem was there weren't like good um outside of like Sarian and Logos and Star Alliance, like the Ghost Hawk wasn't amazing versus the other like with the other houses. Shadows sometimes. Yeah, Shoulder is definitely still in no amber. It is just sitting on the board a lot, yeah. It's a six power taunt thing, it kind of gets in the way. Yeah. You don't really want to fight it. Oh, uh, you missed uh, just the first game, our boy. Yeah, you missed, uh, you missed the double, the double uh, big guy deck. The double giant creature deck was pretty cool. It was pretty good. Zarp with the 100 bits. Thank you, Zarp. Thank you. This is the most bits we've ever gotten. Yeah, I think so. In our lives. <laughs> Another encoder plus archive. With archiving this time. Yeah, it's definitely worth watching. It was a really cool deck. If you had had, like, a bunch of stun cards, I would have just been living that game. <laughs> I still didn't get to use my Niffle Kong because you had so much... I was able to just wipe... Yeah, the wipe you had so much Sanctum on the table. The, uh, the damage that Deosils did, like, did not matter to mm. your Sanctum guys, so... Little bit. 
Oh god. Slippery new sleeves. Slippery new ultimate guard katanas. It was Kong and uh, Deosilis. We now have two Kongs and two Deosiluses. No total. Ultra Gravitron, so... No. I do want to... Hopefully we'll pull one of those. Ultra, uh, you pulled an Ultra Gravitron. That's cool. I bet he's awesome. I mean, Archive 5 is insane, right? So... Archive the top five cards of your deck. Discard a card from Archives of you. Purge a creature and resolve each of its bonus icons as if you played it. Yep, that sounds great. Yeah, no Ultra Gravitron. Not yet. I can imagine a, a double a double big guy deck with Logos um, has got to be good. I'd love to see the triple big guy deck, one of each. Yeah, oh man. That one's got to be, be... That's the dream. That's the dream. I just want to see some sins at this point, honestly. Yeah, we haven't seen any of them yet, <laughs> yeah. so... Probably get there in the next week. Yeah. Cheetah. Probably get there in the next week. It's, it does not like the word kill. It doesn't like the word kill anymore, huh? Okay. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I guess recent uh, recent move on Twitch. Um, I guess it just auto moderates the word kill. So, Death Kong is probably the worst of the three. Yeah. I think so. He's had very little impact in the games that we've seen. So. Yeah. P Rod, P -Rod. Uh, thank you so much, P Rod. <laughs> yeah. I think it's more. I think it was more directing that word at at streamers. Yeah. So I think understandable for them to auto moderate it, but Kong did a lot of card advantage. But I can't make Nathan shave. I, not, I do not have that power. Uh, well, it's for it does thin your deck. Um, for uh, carbs down. What's up, God? How that, how that's because when you slipped all that stuff around, uh, I had not gone out um, into public for a while because I need to buy a new beard trimmer. But uh, due to the increasing number of uh, uh, cases of COVID in our state, um, I have elected to stay indoors for the time being. So uh, you are first. Mm -hmm. I'm first, okay. Okay. I'll play... Let's play daughter. Okay, I am going to say shadows. I'm going to play fidget and vandalize. This is actually a combo. Um, not yeah, this you turn, set it up. But, but you could set it up. So. Uh, I am just going to discard this uh, stirring grave. Yeah, it's probably good to... You know, Oh my god, you better put them back in the order. Give me these. These better, these better be back in the order that I had them. Okay. It's not gonna matter, but yes. Alright, and your turn. I'll draw to you. Number four, Clipper's Beard? Nope. Bad. <laughs> yeah, I'm a five guy myself, thanks. Uh, okay. Is that it? Yeah. Say Sanctum, play Gorm of Om. Play... Zealot. Mad. Oh, he's mad. Play Bulwark. Fight the Fidget. Play Don't get to do anything cool. Demo Knight. Go ahead. All right. I will say Untamed. I'll play Ritual of the Hunt. I'll play Ghost Talk. I'll play Key Frog. Take your turn. Hang for all the cool shit that I got to do last game. Play Logos. Play Dimension Door. That has a capture icon on it. I'll 
I'll reap with the daughter. Play auto encoder. Hey, he gets a treat. Nice, nice. We'll get that for this Castaway turn. cosplay. Play Umex and draw a card. Play Munchling. Play Animator, which also has a capture icon on it. Get that A tree real quick for you. Uh, so Ritual Hunt lets you use your Untamed guys. I guess I'll go ahead and blow that up. Okay. All right, quick Eddie treat. Okay. Uh, it's barely in the frame. Oh. Barely in the frame. Oh, we, oh, get, oh everybody's throwing up. <laughs> <laughs> Still looking at me? Okay. Yeah, Bulwark gives assault. Yep. Bulwark's really good, by the way. I like Bulwark better than Bulwark. Bulwark's done so much work. Yeah. I mean, Justin's opened, I don't know, 15 of them. <laughs> it seems like it. Uh, every deck that he has has like two of them in it, so. But. Yeah. Okay, your turn. It would have been really funny to put the bed, put the katana box under the bed. <laughs> we just keep moving the katana box around the room. All right, I'll say Sanctum. I'll play Gormavam. I'll play Angry Mobs. I'll put a shoulder armor on this Angry Mob. And it's your turn. All right, I'll say Sanctum. I'll play Font of the Eye. Play Ardent Hero. The General Salvador. Actually, he'll go over here. Fight key frog. Pick two. No, no. It'll assault. Assault, yeah. Fight ghost talk. Reap. I'll say untamed. I'm gonna play a dark fairy. I am gonna lost in the woods. I get the demon knight and the daughter. Uh, my dark fairy and this angry mob. And I'll play a fandangle. And then it's your turn. Yeah, Elven Guard sent us uh, these this pack of sleeves. They're very very generous. Yep, yep. We're doing a giveaway sometime next week. So. I don't know how many we're giving away yet, but we'll we probably do two at a time, two boxes, because yeah. that's got, five decks, right? Yeah. So we got um, we got some to give away next week. So. Okay. I'll say, uh, I'll say this. I'll play Essence Scale. Get an Ember. Play Imp Spectre. Capture. Play this Ritual of Tognoth. One, two, three, and a Capture Icon. Uh, I'm gonna destroy this Inspector and Emax Purge Shoulder Id. Gonna play Bone Saw. I'll Stirring Grave my Inspector and. I can't wonder, no, I did not. I'll fight is that a second stirring grave? It is not. Oh, it, it is. is. Yeah, it is. Oh, you discard the other one. That's right. Yeah. Um, 
Yeah, I'll fight Fandangle. And Font of the Eye. Zealot. Okay. Check with seven. Okay. I am going to say Sanctum. I'm going to Gormov on the Essence Scale. Uh, I'm going to play an Angry Mob. This Angry Mob is going to fight Bulwark. For the fight, I guess it will. Nathan did have a nuts uh, auto encoder deck. Yeah, I had the what's its face to go with it. Oh, hey. Enhanced one. Oh, man. Uh, I'll do a damage to. Who? Two damage to Sling. Okay. And you turn out we'll Definitely did that. Uh, it hit. It's good. Well, oh, is that back? We back. Okay. Weird. Did you hear me blame Eddie for this? <laughs> Weird. Okay. So we're back. We're back. Played Umex. Drew a card. Gonna play the Archivist. Who's a draw me a card? Play Bot Booked in. Play Munchling. You've had so much more card advantage in this game. The daughter, like, not having an answer. There's so many creatures that have to die in the set. If you, like, don't have an answer for any of them, yeah. then things get bad. I'll reap with the auto encoder. Oh, yeah, that's it. Okay, I'm gonna say Sanctum. I'm gonna play Gizzleheart Zealot. It's going to play Ready and Enraged. Um, I will have this angry mob fight this ardent hero. Oh, no, you can't, 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 can't. can't. I, you got it because of shoulder armor. Yeah. Um, this angry mob will fight ardent hero. So I'll discard until I hit an angry mob. There we go. Uh, this angry mob will die. No, I don't have the loop, no. That would be good though. That is one good way to get an archives. Um, I'll play an angry mob. This angry mob is going to fight uh, General Salvador. Before the fight, we'll mill. I'll hook this other angry mob. <laughs> play this angry mob. Gizzle hearts. This angry mob. There's some ads. It's going to fight. Um, bot booked in. And then Gizzleheart Zell is going to fight the Munchling. Oh, I guess I would mill with this one. 
Uh, I would have known the last card was Master of the Grey. I can actually kind of draw that, but... It does um, say you may. Uh, it's fine. I, I was going to mill. Okay. okay, and your turn. I will draw. Yeah, right. I love that they have digital pitchforks. <laughs> That's pretty funny. It's like... All right, I'll say this. Yeah, I can't. I can't tell if they're helping either. I'll play Inspector. I'll play a Waking. Oh, he captures. Play a Waking Nightmare. Play another Waking Nightmare. Play Mark of Dis on the Angry Mob. And Gizzleheart Zealot. Excuse or me. That Zealot, yeah. Kill that. Bones and Angry Mob's uh... mad that you don't know the difference between them and Zealots. <laughs> Bone saw will trade with your shoulder armored. Anger Mob, he's too powerful. And Font of the Eye will capture one. That's it. Check with six. Okay. I am. I feel like six is almost never good for a key in this set because of all the capture. Yeah. Uh, I'll say Untamed. I'm going to play Trimble. Is this good here? He's already got. Uh, so Tremble is a card we haven't seen yet. It's a mutant. This is each mutant gains skirmish. I'll play Niffle 8 and I'll play Dark Fairy. <laughs> uh, this Dark Fairy lets me capture one, so I'll capture on two. And it's your turn. I'll draw three. Okay. I will say <laughs> this deck is bad. Sanctum, pick up the archive. Play this deck is bad. I just want to demo night. I want to play journals. I'm trying, man. I want to just be done with this game. I'll play a Commandeer. I'll play a Commandeer. This is a damage Sweet. icon. I, I, have, I don't have Amber. I don't generate I Amber. I fight your creatures ineffectually. I don't con really control your Amber. I kind of... I take a turn. I play like two to three cards. Mostly just two cards. And then... I'll smite the Zalvador into that angry mob. This one? Yeah. I don't get to do any of the cool stuff that exists in this set. I'll fight this Dark Fairy. Look, man, I've had some games like that. Ilya. Like, a, probably a lot of games like that. Um, is it? Was All right, I am going to say Shadows. I'm going to play Seeker Noodle. I am going to play Shoulder Ed. I am going to play Vandalize. Oh, my opponent's cards in my hand. If I play, I don't think a card. Uh, you got like okay. Well, my guy's discarded then. Hey. <laughs> um, I don't think you can ever have a card. No. It can never go to your hand. It, your opponent card can never go to your hand or your deck. Ever. Yeah, a card can't or, go to a zone that isn't play. Yeah, unless it's archive. Unless and it says archive specifically. Yeah. and it says opponent. Your from your opponent's cards. Uh, I will tempting offer. Uh. The Demo Knight. Return my hand? Yeah, you gain one. Uh, yep, yeah, good. Draw. This deck is really bad. This deck is really bad. It's not, it's not fun to play. I'll say Logos. I like this I deck. Want, I want to go back to playing any deck would look good versus this. I want to go back to playing giant creatures. I'll play a causal loop. That deck captures so much amber. Yeah. Let's archive, and I get to archive a card. Play a munchling and a daughter. Kill, kill that idiot. Munchling's gonna fight that guy. Or he's dead. I'm gonna discard the causal loop to gain one. I'll reap. I'll reap. I'll auto encoder. No, other way, but. Yeah. Enemy or the auto encoder. And I'll capture one. Yep. Okay. I can't stop an amber. So. Okay. This deck doesn't control amber. It uh, doesn't let you have any fun. Like you. you have zero fun I think, I think Angry Mob is a common denominator for not so great. Bad decks. Yeah. 
Nangry Mob was the only thing that did anything. Like a deck that. that bad is definitely uncommon. I mean, that, that's like a thing, and that's Keyforge, right? It's like, you definitely have a chance to just open up a deck. A completely dud deck. Yeah. That deck was a dud. But that's why Reversal exists, right? Yeah. Or Adaptive. Or Adaptive. Five Angry Mobs. That's way too many. We knew the fate of that deck before. Yeah. Oh god, this deck has four angry mobs. Oh my god. Judge Thompson. Judge Thompson's pretty good. There's gotta be a guy out there named Judge Thompson that plays Keyforge. <laughs> oh man. Mr. Jackfeet, the perfect commander. Why the blue sticker? I wonder if that's like where it was produced. Language marker for the printers, okay. Punctuate your giveaway room. Well, I, mean, I actually have an enhanced Niffle Ape, hmm. but no Niffle Call. Never gonna happen. <sighs> Uh, yeah, draw card, Rad Penny. That's pretty mm, good. Yeah, pretty good. Pretty sweet. Redacted. Cyber Clone. Sorry, it's looking pretty good. Sorry, it looks crazy in this deck, actually. Holy crap. Shame about all these angry mobs. I did open a Kurzap, yeah. Jeez. Looks like a gateway. Nice. You don't need a gateway for all my niffles. Yep. Got another pack of sleeves for two more sleeves. Judge Thompson. Jack Feet. It's coming for Judge Thompson. Mr. Jack Feet. Yeah. Sorry. Skix Uno needs to have yeah. some rules epic you. What does what does he do? Average number of enhanced cards probably like seven. I don't think it's seven. No, no, it's probably it's probably closer to like four. Four, four or five is the average. Destroy each other creature for each creature destroyed this way. Give him a plus one power counter. That's pretty great. And this deck has three. So I had a deck that had zero. I had a deck that had one. I have four. Okay. I, mean, I have one deck that had like 12.
You would just uh, you would just order all the destroyed triggers, right? Because you could like, uh, <laughs> yeah. So like, you could order all the destroyed triggers on your creatures first, and then, no, on the opponent's creatures first. And it won't, it wouldn't, you could do all of your, uh, yeah, you could do all yours first, move your amber to their one guy, that guy dies and only comes to one of yours. Yes. I think maybe I don't think I mean he doesn't get the counters until all the creatures are destroyed and all the creatures aren't destroyed destroyed until I still have no clue how to look at a deck list to know if something's good or not yeah this is pretty inscrutable so far yeah I, mean, I think you want some number of board wipes. Definitely. Like, I mean, that last game was a, an example. Uh, you rolled a four and I rolled a five. So I am first. Um, I'll keep, I will say... Um, I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna mulligan this. And it was close to good, but it just like it was reactive. It was like too reactive. Yeah, I don't like that. I had that disc deck earlier where I was just like, all the stuff does damage and wants to kill your creatures, but then you just can never play creatures. So okay, I am. Yeah, I would say after after everything dies, that's when he gets power counters. Yeah, I'm gonna say Sanctum. I'm gonna play Gizzleheart Zealot. He's gonna shoot himself. <laughs> he's so mad. He's an extra man. Um, he's a rage, but he has got nothing to fight, so he's just gonna reap. Okay, yeah, that's your turn. I'll draw one. Play Logos. I will play Qmax and draw. Diametric Charge the Zealot. Play Smoko Dynamo Infomorph. Uh, I'm gonna say untamed. I'm gonna savage clash. Uh, since we capture one, was that? Yeah. So the Q Max goes to the archives, and the archive a random one with Smoko. And then I'll play a Niffle Ape and a Niffle Queen. It's your turn. I will draw. Uh, start my turn. I'm gonna discard this Q Max from the archive to gain one. I'll say dis and put the archive up. Play Bobble, play Bobble, play Brabble, play Brabble, play Inspector, play Infernus. I'm gonna Infernus myself, I think. Get this Infomorph and this uh, Smoko. Brabble, Brabble, Bobble, Bobble. This <laughs> is <laughs> just blabbering over there. Just brabbling over here. Speak English. Your turn. Okay, I am going to say, um, Sarian. 
I'm gonna beware the eyes on Nobu Dynamo. Boom! Bang. Hit him with the, the strike. I am gonna play Citizen Strix and Exalt and steal one. I am going to play Quintina. So after a creature reaps, exalt it. I am going to play Senator Shrix, and uh, i got to exalt him. And then I'm going to play Ancient Power for each friendly creature with am uh, Amber on it. So. Horn, horn. Okay, your turn. I will draw five. Okay. Say Logos, or I'm sorry, say Shadows. I'll look over there. I guess the zealot. Okay. He's not a mutant, right? I'll dark wave to do two to each non mutant creature. It's gonna kill all these stupid imps. So I'll destroy two and just purge a card from your hand. Play a red penny, steal one, and draw a card. We're playing as Coda Shadows right here. Play Spike Trap. Here's it. Okay, I am. Um. I'm gonna say Untamed. I'm gonna play Song of the Wild, then I'll play Punctuated Equilibrium. Holy jeez. Okay. I am gonna play a Fandangle and a. My deck is Mr. Jackfeet, the perfect commander. Ghost Hawk. So I'm going to Ghost Hawk here. So he's going to reap twice, but steal one and generate two with the. Reap twice. He's Exalt twice. Well, I've got Song of the Wild. So he generates two when I reap with him. And then I have to Exalt, exalt him. him once and steal one, right? I Exalt him again because it Oh, okay, two. okay. Yeah. And then this Shrix is going to reap. And exalt twice and generate two and steal one. And then, um, yeah, screw it. We're all in. I'll reap with the Niffle Ape, exalt it, get two, reap with the Niffle Queen, exalt it, and get two, check with ten. Your turn. We'll draw uh, two. I'll say this. I will pain reaction that guy. Uh, reap with this guy. Dominator Bobble will reap here. They're exalted. I will not do that. I will do this one. Okay. Uh, I'll play break key. Okay. I will use spike trap. Then I'll play Skeksuno. So okay. destroy everything. For each creature destroyed. So he'll get six. Okay, a lot of amber on the table now. Any reaction, Ghost Talk? Oh, well, whatever. Uh, oh, yeah. yeah. I mean, it's all ended up about the same. 
I think you wanted the most. It would just be with a with a spike trap still in play. You you wanted the most. Well, you wanted the most number of creatures to die to Skixuno. Anyway. I don't really care about his power, to be honest, but it's it's whatever. So. Yep. Skixuno. He's pretty good. Okay, so I'll forge. Um. I will say Saurians. I'll play Grimlock as ducks. Uh, all ancient power. It's open to untap and you get to play that ancient power, but it's key. such such is life. Uh, I'll say check with six. It's your turn. I'll draw two. Forge. I'll say logos. I'm gonna play this. Your key. <laughs> yeah, I'll play the cyberclone and purge. No, I can't. This is supported. I'll play. I'll play this. I will. Mark of this him. Reap with Skixuno. Then implosion to kill both. Not a good matchup, I feel. You gotta call sorry, so. But you do forge. Uh, yeah. Gale top to go. Three. What a game. I'll say shadows. Okay. Now I'll say play Logos. I'll play Munchling and I'll play the Cyberclone. The Purge. Yep, sweet. I can't stop you. So. Fastest game. Oh. Alright. That's it. <laughs> okay, there you have it. Yeah, Skixono is going to be uh, worth his weight in gold, I think, this set. Yeah, that card's stupid. Yeah. I, mean, I was expecting Gateway, I guess. Mm -hmm. um, so, so one of the gateways in this deck has a draw card on it. Pretty cool. Yeah, that's kind of cool. Yeah, I was I was expecting a gateway or whatever, but uh, you had like I had wards, yeah. so I thought some of my guys would live, but you just had you had so much destruction that my wards did not matter. I wanted to take a sanctum turn after you uh, destroyed everything, but um, the skix unit was too big because mm. uh, I had an angry mob and gray rider, and it's just you're killing you off your angry mob at that point, so. Which is not good. And I'm like milling myself for no reason. Okay, let's not get an angry mob deck. I'm going to turn myself into an angry mob if I draw more angry mobs. I see angry mobs in this deck. There's a lot of blue cards in this deck. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay. No angry mobs. No, oh, this deck is a triple bulwark deck. All right, I'll teach you how it feels. I do not hate bulwark. Like in multiples, he just it's... like stacks up God. the assaults. Yeah, we need a digital pitchfork emote. Look at all those blue cards. How many is that? I don't know. A lot. Uh, well, several. Yeah. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. I just wonder how that hurts, like the quality of card. We'll yeah, see. how many of them like actually have text? Yeah, this is it just a bunch of bonus icons at that point? Rat catcher Arn. Hmm. I love the two, the two word names. Yeah, those are the best. I think those are they're concise. Those are nice. They tell a story most of the time. I have a, I have a red penny with a capture. Blue means the card is enhanced with a, <laughs> with an a bonus icon. Uh, this secret noodle has two capture enhances on it. Mm, I hate on artifacts. I hate them on artifacts, yeah. man. Ah, uh, Gamgee. I feel like Gamgee is my calling card. Gamgee is good. Let's have a game G. I have an and Claude. It's the first of both. It might be. Well, Mobius. Uh, you had a deck that had both, I think. Mobius Scroll having a draw card is kind of cool. Yeah, that's actually pretty good. 
Fission Bloom has a draw card. Okay. Oh. Ooh, I don't care. I definitely like that card a lot. This one I would say is well above average. The the enhanced. Yeah, the amount of enhanced cards. Yeah, that's like I, that is the most I think we've seen. Yeah, so definitely. Far. Fifteen is. 15 is up there. Tessa, the illustrator from Duff Alley. Yeah, the <laughs> very one. Rat catcher arm. What if there's an all enhanced deck now? That would be really difficult, I think. Yeah. I mean, it's. You get like two M4 Capturas. You get like two Splinters in the same deck. Mm. That's like. Uh, 24 icons between the two of them, so. Yeah, Plague Rats, that'd be good. I bet Plague Rats are actually really good in this set if you had them. Uh, not every card would have to, right? Because um, each card, most of the cards that provide enhancements provide more Multiples. than one. Yeah. So I think the easiest way to do it would be to have... Multiples of the, yeah. per, the freaking Star Alliance chick and the yeah. Saurian Mutagenesis thing. researcher. What's up, Mortis? Hey, what's up? Yeah, I do have Master of the Are Grey. you freaking kidding? I hate I, that card. I have never hated a card as much as I hate that card. God. I'm gonna mulligan hard for it. I'm just mad. Shit is fun. I'm mad thinking about that card. Turn his so turn is fun right off. It's so lame. God, it's so lame. Wham. <laughs> <laughs> I noticed that now you're using clear sleeves and you're not uh, complaining about complaining it. About it. <laughs> because I am an honorable uh, player. <laughs> Nine, okay. I will keep. Hmm. All right, I'll, I'll keep it. Play the auto encoder. Okay, I'm gonna say Sanctum. I'm gonna play Ardent Hero, Bulwark, and Gorvanol. Okay. Gorvanol is okay. really good though. Your turn. I'll draw three. I'll say Star Alliance. Play Teleporter Chief. Think. I think I'll play uh, Explore Over and draw a card. I'll play Observe you, Max. Explore Over. One to the art in here. That's it. Okay. I am going to say Sanctum. I'm going to play Bulwark. This bulwark is going to assault for the explorer river. Arden here is going to assault to the teleporter chief. Uh, Gorvanal's captured all that stuff. Mm -hmm. Gorvanal's just going to reap himself. And your turn. Hey, shadows. I will draw one. All red penny to steal one. All opportunist to the red penny. <laughs> you think I can't. I'll discard this mean cut first to archive the top part. I am going to say Sanctum. I'm going to play Baranon. He's going to capture. God, this is Bulwark. This is going to be an all Sanctum game. I'm just going to lose. Uh, I'm going to reap with Bulwark. You can have this red penny. I'll reap with Bulwark. Oh, yeah, I mean, that's... 
I'll reap with Arden Hero. Yeah, I'll reap with Gorgon all. Better answer these. Um I'm thinking about it. No, no, no you, you stole it from me. Okay, go ahead. I'll draw one. What if I turned all of my creatures into shorties? Okay, I'll say, say the little bit of mixed archive. Play a Fission Bloom, draw a card. I'll play Library Access this turn. I'll play a Mobius Scroll and draw a card. <laughs> uh, Legacy Library Access. Play Opposition Research. And so draw a card. Reap and draw a card. <laughs> I'll play Eclectic Inquiry to archive the top two cards. Okay. All right. I am going to say Shadows. I'm going to play Safe House. I am going to. Does. Let's do all your guys. Uh, your these guys. guys are mutants. Uh, he's got armor. There's one here and two to there. For an uh, I guess that's fine. I'll I'll play Dark Wave. Um, so Gorvanal takes one, Arden Hero takes two. Um, I'm gonna play a Gamgee and draw a card. And then I will play actually I should play Gamgee on this side. Shouldn't should leave this spot open for somebody who's good at fighting. And then I'll play another Gamgee. And it is your turn. I will draw three. All right, I'll say Shadows and pick up the Archive. Uh, dark Wave. Okay, so our hero's dead, Gormor all takes one, all my Gamgees are dead. Pay for that. Reap with the Rad Penny. Mug my Rad Penny. Play Rad Penny, we'll capture and steal. Uh, is it? Uh, he's enraged. Oh, she's mean. Yeah. What are your cliff note reactions to the set? Uh, that anything could happen. Yeah, it's uh, it's very unpredictable at this yeah. point. Um, so expect the unexpected. Completely unpredictable. All right, I'm gonna say Sanctum. I'm gonna play Baronon. Who is a capture one? I'll capture one on this one. Um, actually, he'll capture. Yeah, he'll capture one on that one. Um, this bulwark is gonna fight uh, Rad Penny. Um, after I fight with a creature, I capture one. Um, does the assault stop his ability from working? I, don't I honestly so. have no idea. Um, I don't think it does. Same I think thing it with stops the, the fight effects, right? Yeah, but same thing the, with the um, zealot, right? Oh, this guy draws a card. Same with like enrage. rage. Yeah. Um, okay, so this Baronon is going to reap. He'll capture two, um, even though he's enraged. There's no mutants for him to fight. Bulwark is going to reap. And then Gorvanal is going to reap. Uh, I did get that Doom Gamer uh, eventually, so I don't know when you typed that. So, um, and go ahead, because I'm I'm at six now. So he was the only card I played. All right, I'll say Star Alliance. I got Pete. No, that's cool. Uh, the, you, we are known to miss things, so definitely, uh, definitely double check us on a lot of this stuff. So. Play Commander Chan, draw. Play Techno Alien, draw. Play Researcher, do a damage to something that has armor. Angry mobs are bad, bad. Play Commander Chan. Angry mobs are bad, 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 bad. Your turn. All right, so I'll forge. Oh, this guy's in rage. You keep playing mutants. I get so mad when you play mutants, Justin. <laughs> Archive top for the discard. 
What did I discard? It's from hand. Yeah, it doesn't work for Scalpy. After a card is discarded from your hand, the autoencoder uh, archives. So. I just say Sanctum. It's a lot of dumb, dumb nerds over there. Um, I might like get. I've, I've getting nowhere in my deck. Problem is if I like take this turn and like play this stuff, I get nowhere. So, uh, yeah, it's sanctum, I guess. So Bulwark is gonna attack the Techno Alien. I've gotten two uh, two Archivist decks, but none of them can really reliably archive the Archivist. Yeah, seems he's tough to get to work. I think. Yeah, it's just so much setup. Uh, Bulwark is gonna fight the Scout Pete and assault to him down, and uh, or sorry, assault four. Each of them are yeah. gonna assault four. Uh, he's gonna capture two. Uh, I guess these Baronons have to fight, huh? Um, so this Baronon is going to fight Commander Chan. Um, he'll take two. His rage goes away. His anger has subsided. For now, the Gorvernal is going to capture. Um, this Baronon is going to fight the Immunogenesis Researcher. His anger subsides. And then Gorvanal will just reap. You going late again tonight, or are you guys playing any around normal 9.30? Probably around 9.30 or 10. Yeah, I think, I'm thinking 9.30. Yeah. I'm thinking 9.30. We'll see where we are. But yeah, around that time. Normal, like, basically normal end time. Uh, go ahead. Okay. I just can't, I just can't let your board get out of hand. Say Logos. I'm gonna use the Fission Bloom to resolve bonus icons twice. I'll play a Daughter, draw two. Okay. This is the story of two icons here, man. Titan Engineer, Smoko, and shoot the guy. Uh, this guy? Yeah. Yep. Play Keo, play. I'm just, I'm just gonna discard this info more. Did you play a mutants? You did play mutants. Oh, God, I'm angry! I just keep getting. I just took too much damage on this Baron. Yeah, I'll discard this. Okay. And then I will use the Mobius Scroll to archive two cards. Your turn. Okay. Um, what are the chances I win the game if I just keep finding you off the table? I don't know. Honestly, don't I have no clue. Uh, the problem here's the thing. My hand is bad. So if you take that turn, it's just like me going, oh, yeah. yeah. And I, you're like, <laughs> yeah. wow, I get to untap one daughter and yeah. all this other. So, yeah. Um, okay. It's uh, Sanctum time. Bulwark is going to assault four down Keo. Bulwark is going to assault four down Commander Chan. Gorvanal is going to assault two down daughter. Or if I should have done this differently. Um, because now these Baronons have to fight into Okay, and this Baronon's gonna fight the Smoko. Now I just choose to do nothing with this Baronon. Okay. Yeah, so, right, your turn. Say shadows, pick up the archive. I need a turn where you don't put like five creatures on the table. I'm just like getting so much draw. I, yeah, and stuff, yeah, so. I know, I know, Justin. <laughs> so sorry, but yeah, okay, I get it. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna say shadows and look over there. This will work. Okay, so pick one. Here's your bad. Here's your rad penny. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah, okay. I'm getting. You, you, if you play this rad penny and you steal this one, I am doing that. But hold, okay. just calm down. Because I gotta, I gotta like capture icons on, and this is all weird. I'm attempting off for that guy. Okay, so these are all back there. And you get one. It's your rad penny, both of them. Hold on. There's one I have to capture. Oh, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Play Gamgee. Play Red Penny. Yeah, my anger is back. 
Play Francis. Play the Red Penny. I've captured this one. And play Subtle Auto. Card a card. You fool. You absolute <laughs> fool. I'm going to Opportunist on this Francis. Okay, well. <laughs> yes. Now I can draw a card. Alright, that's it. Alright, Saint Sanctum. Playing Gorvanal. Uh, we're going to commence extermination. Um, this Baranon's going to fight down this Gamgee. Gorvanal's going to capture one. This Bulwark is going to fight Francis, Salt 4, or we're all going to capture one. Uh, this Baranon's sate his anger now. Uh, this Bulwark is going to reap. And then Baranon, this Baranon's going to fight Subtle Auto. Yeah, it's your turn, I will draw one. Did you get all the captures, right? Uh, no, I had two more fights in there. So, two more fights. I fought. Three times. I fought three times. Three times. Fought, yeah, I fought three times. So I still do forge. Yeah, you do forge. Okay, we finally did it. I gotta kill this. <laughs> I'll say. I'll say logos. I will fight Gorbanal. Dang. The, the, end, the tyranny is over. I will use Vision Bloom, play the Mobius Scroll, and draw two. Nah, man. <laughs> you you want you want me to let him untap with daughter plus a bunch of other garbage with all of this sanctum stuff that all says draw cards on it multiple times. It, like Mobius scroll. No, no, I'm not doing that. I'm not doing it. Imagine if you had that guy that like uh, gains two every time he fights the most powerful creature. Yeah. That, then you'd be. I would be in dominating. The business. Yeah. yeah. I would be. Or if you so have the guy out that cancels my icons. Yeah. It'd be different. I would have lost the hell Justin has already played. Justin has played so his entire deck. I will. He's on. He's on the second playthrough of his deck. He's played both these rad pennies twice already. I'm gonna discard this infomorph. Dark Eye card. That's a great use of the, of, of this these crappy creatures. Alright, that's it. That's it? Yep. I, I had to take that turn basically to kill that stupid guy. Oh gotcha, gotcha. Otherwise I can just fight you off the yeah. table and yeah. Okay. Now I will play Logos. I will play my card with a draw card on it. Standardized testing. These two. Ones and sixes. I will now play a prescriptive grammar bot and capture one onto, you, I guess, this bear or not. And then I'm going to play an even Ivan and a Xenobot. And it's your turn. I will draw three. The deck needs the Logos card that archives all creatures. Oh, yeah. God, that would be insane. Yeah. Yeah, like I'll just archive my table and then uh, d d play my draw my deck. Alright, say Saint or say Starlands, pick up the archive. Play fight him, off to let, fight him to let off steam. Play armor off from Nell. He's enhanced. He's enhanced. They're all enhanced. Play Hapless Cadet. Play Hmm. We haven't seen that one yet, right? Yeah. Taunt destroyed your opponent. Oh god. Yeah, he's insane. This is a red shirt. I'll play Techno Alien and draw a card. Play Crewman Jor, who's never going to be able to steal one. Uh, you've played some mutants, I see. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, I played mutants. These guys are in range. I think this is going to be a really easy thing to forget. I'm going to play Observe You Max on this guy. So I gain an Amber, do a damage. Draw a card. Play Universal Translator. So game number. Draw a card. That's it. Okay, I'm gonna say Sanctum. I'm gonna play Champion and Alphil and Master of the Gray. And the Scrivener, Favian, 
Actually, I'll play Scribner, Fabian, then Champion, now he'll, then Master of the... Ha! Ha 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 See if I'll let you have any fun now. My fun is over. Okay. Um, what, uh, what do I do about that table there? I guess uh, this Baranon fights the hapless cadet. Uh, it takes one, and I lose these two. Um, the alternative is to go to three and let you... That card is insane. Good God, that card is insane. Mm -hmm. um, he, his anger subsides for now. Um, this Baranon... He doesn't have anything that's like giving him more power, so Bulwark is going to blow up this guy. And then this Bulwark is going to blow up Truman Yorg. And then this Baranon is going to fight No. Okay. And it's your turn. Okay. I will draw three. Let's see, Logos play daughter. Hard to discard these guys. Yeah, I'm just gonna chuff these three guys in the discard pile. I guess I can do one at a time. Um, yeah. So I'll do I'll discard one. I'll discard one. I'll discard one. Okay. Mobius scroll. Yeah, I'll use Mobius scroll. Your turn. Okay, I am going to say Sanctum. Not Sanctum. I'm going to say Logos. Say Logos. You're just going to steal so much from me. Can't get your own Amber. This is why I take away your bonus icons. Yeah, I know. Pretty mad about it. Hmm. I just take the shadow's turn. Yeah. Yeah, I'll take the shadow's turn. I'll play Seeker Needle. I'll play Subtle Auto and discard a card from your hand. Red Penny roleplay? I am Red Penny. I'm so cool. What was that? I could reap right now, but... Um... Uh, I'll play Rad Penny and steal one from you. I could reap right now, but um, I don't like the outcome. I go to six. Justin steals two from me, so I don't forge. Um, he goes up to a bunch. Um, I don't. I don't like it. I don't like it. Uh, and then I'm gonna safe house Rad Penny uh, and Archiver. Yeah. Uh, your turn. I will draw three. Okay, I'll say Logos. I'll play Opposition Research. Um, so you can't reap. Okay. I'll discard this info. I'll reap with Daughter. And uh, that's it. I am going to say Logos. No, sorry, Sanctum. I'm going to say Sanctum. Um, he was a mutant. I made my own guys mad. Hmm. Okay. I am going to have Bulwark uh, to explode the daughter. I'm going to reap with Master of the Grey. They can't reap. 
I'm going to say, yeah, whatever. I'll say Sanctum. Dead Daughter. I'll play Burning Glare and stun an enemy creature. And it's your turn. I will draw one. Well, right, Shadows again. I'm trying to get through my deck some. I got I got stuff in my hand, Herp. <laughs> I'm not trying to tell you what's in my hand so that Justin knows it's in my hand. But I got stuff in my hand. Okay. It's called yes. timing. I'm trying right, to time say... trying to time the stuff in my hand. Um let's say Starlands, so I'm just gonna discard two cards. Sure. He's clearly saving up for something. My turn. Yep. Uh, so you're at five still? Yep. I have not generated it. Okay. I will say Sanctum. I can't use bonus icons, so... Um, I am going to reap with this dude. He's going to capture two. He's gonna re I'm going to reap with this dude. He's going to capture two. I'll reap with Master of the Grey. I got Anaphiel. I'll... Reap with Scribner Fabian. I'll reap with Bulwark. I'll reap with Bulwark. I will play Baldric the Boar Bold. Oh shit, you do have him. Yeah. Oh my god, I didn't know you had that guy. Holy yeah, shit. I finally got to him. Okay. Well, I'll say check with nine. Okay. And it's your turn. I'll say Shadows and Bold Archive. Draw one. Attempting offering that stupid master the gray. Okay. So I get one. You do get one. Okay. I'll dark wave. Two to each and on you. Armor. Actually, before I do that. This was on the grammar bot, yeah, right? So hold on, hold okay. on that one right there. Because he's not a mutant, right? Yeah. So I'll look over there, this guy. Okay. He had five on him. He had. Yeah, red alert is in the set, but I haven't seen it out of his deck. I've seen like a little no, dark wave. Okay, so the grammar bot dies. This Baronon dies. Uh, Bulwarks take nothing, nothing, nothing. Anaphil takes one, and Subtle Auto takes nothing. So the red penny, steal one. Play red penny, he's five power, right? I'll oh, capture one there and steal one. I'll mug this red penny. I'll play two opportunists. Discard this Francis. Okay. Okay. I am
going to play Effervescent Principle. That's why I didn't do any of this hurt, because I wanted to get to the point where I was either going to forge or force him to play all that stuff, so that he was going to take all the stuff that he could, so I could hit him with the Effervescent. Um, it doesn't do me any good to go to like six or eight or whatever, have him stop me, and then I have to like discard a bunch of stuff. I wanted to forge. I didn't expect him to deal with 10 amber worth or whatever, but anyway, uh, Effervescent, I got a chain. Um, I will play, uh, I gotta do a damage. I'll do a damage to one of my guys with armor. Um, I will play Dimension Door and draw a card. Oh, Nathan lose too, yeah. Yes. Um, I am gonna reap with Xenobot, steal one, I'll discard one, discard this other bulwark and draw. I will diametric charge that rad penny. I'll play Odd Claude. I'll play an Infomorph. I will reap with even Ivan and steal one. And I'll play this opposition research because why? Okay. Uh, your turn. I'll say check with seven. I'll drop a chain and draw three. Okay. I'll say Star Alliance. I'm going to discard all these cards. <laughs> Good. All right. So I forge. Yep. Did I just say Sanctum? Yeah, probably. I'll say Sanctum. I'll play Master of the Grey. I do have an even number. Um, reap with a Nafiel. I mean, I'm not, you've got the Rad Pennies. Um, I'll reap with Scrivener Fabian. I'll reap with Bulwark. I'll reap with Bulwark. I'll reap with Baranon. He'll capture two. We need any amount of board controls deck. I uh, know. It would yeah, be it, so dumb if it did. If you could, like, yeah. Yeah, because you, 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 you see whatever card in that deck that you want. Yeah. So, yeah. It's like a, it's like a standardized testing off from being, like, ridiculous. Yeah, exactly. Oh, it's standardized testing would be stupid. This yeah. Deck. Yep. I agree. It's like it's like really close to being dumb. Mm -hmm. All right, I'll pick up the archive. Yeah, these bulwarks have been in play since the beginning of the game, right? <laughs> yeah, I haven't. I've just all, all I've been able to do is return stuff to your hand. I don't think I've killed anything. No, well, I killed a, a couple things with like I've I've traded some of my stuff off. I killed like uh, some gamgees with the wave or whatever, but yeah, just too many mutants in here for the wave to be good. Yeah, no, you're not captured. I'll play subtle auto. I'll discard these two guys. Yeah, Boris just let him like kill all my stuff for free. Yeah, my turn. Mm -hmm. I will say shadows and put my archives into my hand. I am gonna play the seeker needle and steal two with Scrivener Fabian. This deck probably like does really well against those rush decks though. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Better low creatures. Uh, I'll play Rad Penny and steal one. I will play Boss Derek. Taking this guy elusive. I'll vandalize you. Uh, this one, please. I will Seeker Needle your subtle auto. I will reap with this subtle auto. I will safe house Rad Penny. And it is your turn. Yeah, that's it. That's finally it. I took I took like seriously, it was like five sanctum turns in a row playing no cards from my hand. <laughs> See, that shows the haters. 
All you sanctum haters out there. No, yeah. Don't blow your planet up. Polwark is so stupid, dude. He's really good. That, like, there's a lot of four power creatures in this deck, so if you have like two bulwarks, it's just kill everything. Actually, so it's just it's years for a bit. Oh man. Rest in peace, Doc. His deck's name is Raul Nat King <laughs> Malipity. Oh man. Oh, we got a legacy in here. Hey. Oh, <laughs> what the What? Don't tell him. Don't tell him, chat. I gotta look at it. Chat, now. don't tell him. I gotta look at it. Chat, don't say. Don't you say anything to him, chat. Okay. Say nothing to him. Oh, uh, I was trying to wait while looking at it. Say nothing. No, it's not sense. Not that exciting. But something, something funny. Hmm. You see what I see? <laughs> yeah, I have to turn the legacy, the legacy is a is a red herring. The legacy is not good. Oh, that's a red herring. Okay. The legacy is not good. Don't worry about the legacy. <laughs> five. Count them five. I'm looking at it. Oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> Count them five. Jeez. Oh, it's a, it's a lot. Count them those. five. This is the first five of deck that we have, right? Yeah, I think so. The five of decks are real, like they're real rare anyway. We're gonna be doing a lot of shuffling. We're gonna do some legacy. <laughs> the quicksy stuff. Oh yeah. Oh man. And this mad prophet Gizzleheart, which will not matter. Hmm. Yeah, I have a question for you. Do you need creatures to win the game? I don't know. I, maybe oh, not. God. They reprinted Screaming Cave? Oh. This, I will shuffle this deck 500 times in one <laughs> game. I do have two bone rod items, Nathan. Raul Net King. Did I not scan it? I thought it scanned. It's probably the quotation marks, right? Yeah, sorry. Raul. I don't know how you're supposed to have have or use any creatures against me. <laughs> Ava Cape can definitely be good. If this deck had a uh, a Fangtooth Cavern, holy crap. It'd be the creature the creature hatingest deck I've ever seen. <laughs> yeah, I think I think Kate I mean it's pretty heavy on actions, right? Um Yeah, it does protect me from Infernus, right? I don't know what this deck's doing for Amber Control. Removing opposing creatures? Yeah, it's just letting you never use a creature. Yeah. His Mire. This deck looks bad. Remember real. This is like the worst version of the deck I just played. Do you have a library card? Mm hmm. That's cool. Yeah. Lieutenant Gorval? Yeah, I how I almost supposed to keep my creatures in play. 
I'm going to be shuffling 1.6 creatures into my deck every turn, right? <laughs> <laughs> this deck looks like it beats the pants off of Worlds Collide decks, though. Yeah. It absolutely it just, it it pulls Worlds Collide decks pants all the way around the ankles, makes them trip coming out of the bathroom, just embarrassing themselves in front of the whole school. Kixie library card seems like a nombo. Yeah, it does a little bit. There's not a ton of creatures in this logo side, though. This is probably not a stone deck. This is probably not an anything deck. <laughs> Did you roll her? Uh, I did. No, you rolled I her. Did. Okay. Only three Logos creatures. Okay, that's fair. Uh, I'll mulligan. I'll keep. It's got a lot of Starlands creatures, though. Not a lot of Shadow creatures, though. Library card is an action, so you have to have something to be able to act activate it on a different turn, unfortunately. Yeah, like a... Uh... Yeah, it's not Omni. It's, Poltergeist wasn't printed in this set, I guess. So. Mm -hmm. It's also probably the best borrow target in the world. Yeah, <laughs> that's pretty good. I will play... Uh, Sucker Alien. Okay. I will say this. I'm going to play Screaming Cave, Brabble, and Dark Minion. It's your turn, Elder. Let's say Star Lance. I'll fight the Brabble. Do these. There. There. Anderson, Subject Kirby will play Reckless Rizzo. It's just waiting to die to that Dark Minion. Just itching to die to it. That's it. I will say. Oh, I draw from Chan. Uh, it did not matter. Wow. Uh huh. It didn't even matter with Sacro Alien. I am going to say this. Uh, Dark Minion is going to fight the Subject Kirby. Die, do one damage to everything. I am going to Dance of Doom for five. So I'm just each creature with five power. I am going to play an Umbra Fiend. And is it worth it? I don't actually think it's worth it Screaming Cave here. So. Um, Go ahead. I kind of kind of like something that's in my hands. I'll draw to you. Go. Right, I'll say uh, say logos. I'll standardize testing. Okay. There's nothing to steal yet. Play library card. Play opposition research. Play munchling. Draw a card. Your turn. All right. I'll say untamed. I will lost in the woods. The munchling, and then I will commune, which we have not seen yet, but is a very good card. Oh. I lose all of my amber, and then I gain four. That's amber. super good. I wanted to play that before Screaming Caved. Hmm. And... It's your turn. I'll draw two. Is that uh, rare? Uh, it is uncommon, oh, so wow. we just haven't seen it. Let's see... Uh, Shadows. Play Rad Penny. Play Opportunist. Opportunist is really good. It is sweet. I'm gonna rot her bones. 
Also, uh, your turn. Okay, I am going to say Sanctum. I'm going to play Seeker of Truth and Gorvanal. We're going to give Gorvanal shoulder armor. And then I will play Equalize, which is actually pretty good with Gorvanal. Um, not that I'm getting to do anything this turn with it, but it is pretty good with Gorvanal, I think. Uh, your turn, I will draw. So you logo, so I'm going to archive, or I'm going to use library card. Okay. Start my library access turn. Is it Friday yet? Yeah. If only. Crazy Cat Lady? Uh, Justin got Crazy Cat Lady, right? I did. I actually had a pretty good. Uh, yeah, I think you had lady. all, I think you had like the rare, the uncommon, and a common one, right? Mm -hmm. Like, um, so. I'll play the Grammar Bot and do one to the Seeker. Draw. Density. Oh, the cat lady was open. Yes. It would try to ban it. Try to ban the permitted crazy lady. Oh, mm. okay. I'll play a uh, fortune compiler. Draw. We're talking about a card here. We're not talking about a person. You algorithm. I'll effervescent. Draw. Play. Vision Bloom, draw. Play Cronus, draw. Play Electric Inquiry. I could archive. draw, then archive. You could choose the order, right? Like Wild Wormhole? No, you have to, when you play the card, that's when you draw, then you archive. Okay. Yeah. Play Munchling, draw two, and then archive a card with the Cronus. Play Diametric Charge there. Who did you do the damage with with Prescription? That's Seeker, okay. so you take two. Draw. And that is it, finally. Okay. I am going to say Untamed. I'm going to play Ghost Talk here. I get to capture one. I don't have to make cards. Capture on Gorvanal, I guess. I'll reap with Seeker of Truth. What is this one card? I'll reap with Gorvanal. Um. Let's shuffle them all back in. Okay. So, lost in the woods, lost in the woods. Let's shuffle them all back in. That's yours. Uh, this goes there. That's just what I say when my turn ends. Because I'm not trying to downplay my turn. So check the seven. Okay, I'll say Star Alliance of the Archive. This card red alert. Play Scout Pete. Discard Game G. Play Aiden Oswin. Give him a secure droid. Just in case he untaps. Play Sensor Chief Garcia. Teleporter uh, Chief Teleporter Chief Tink. And I'll play a stone. Yep. I will say Sanctum. I'm gonna Fangs of Gizzleheart and Purge Pete. I'll play Scrivener Favian and uh, Seeker of Truth. It's your turn, I'll draw three. So check with eight. Say Star Alliance. I'm gonna put a Stealth Stir on Hayden. I'm gonna reap and gain two more. Discard this tank. I'll reap with Garcia. I'll reap with Tink. Four for eight. Word all your dudes. Oh heck.
Uh, I'll say untamed. I'll discard Cephalist. I will play Ismire. I'll play Ghost Hawk. And instead of capturing, I'll steal. Um, and Secret Truth is going to reap. Scrivener Fabian's going to reap. And it is your turn. You will forge for eight. I will draw three. Hey, Logos. Jeez. Okay. I'll use Fission Bloom and play as Lethalogica. So I gain two and capture two. And then do the thing. All Shadows cards. Jeez. Okay. And Cronus. Play Cronus. Play Munchling. So I'll draw. Discard this grammar bot. Here, sure. Okay, I am going to say untamed. I'm going to reap with the ghost hawk. I am going to lost in the woods. I'm going to get my ghost hawk seeker of truth. I will get your Munchling and Cronus. So much shuffling. Yeah, it's a lot. Actual legacy magic levels of shuffling over here. I will play Vault's Blessing, so we each gain one Amber for each mutant creature. I took care of those mm -hmm. for you. Um, and then uh, Pismire will just fight Garcia, or do I um, reap? I'll uh, I'll fight Garcia. I don't. It's not like you're gonna. Uh, the taunt. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, taunt and elusive, right? Yeah. So I'll just reap with Fizzmire okay. then. Um, your turn. I'll draw two. I'll say, say Star Alliance. I I can't tell the difference between these two yet. The they're all droid yeah, and they're the, all the same. Yeah. I'm gonna fight, fight the Pismire. Okay. And repeat. And then discard this Met Teleporter Chief. That's I will see this. I'm going to play Relentless Creeper. Uh, I am going to implosion the Relentless Creeper and Garcia. I will play a Drekker and I will not Screaming Cave. I'll say check with nine. Your turn will draw. Forge. Um, shadows. Get the archive. I'll look over there, the scrivener. 
just get one. Play a reckless Rizzo. A little tempting off for the Drekker. Gain one. No, we'll vandalize you. Actually, I can't play this right. Oh, I could play it, yeah. Because you had two. What the fudge? Okay. Uh, That's a good idea, Storm Strong. We put him down below it. Okay, so I forge for six. Mm -hmm. You can't see him right there. I will say untamed. I'm going to lost in the woods. My scrivener Fabian. And uh, Tink and Reckless Rizzo. And then I'll play a Fandangle. And it is your turn, I'll shuffle. We shuffle. I'll play Logos. Uh, I'm gonna Paradise Testing. Play, use the Bloom and play Left Logica. Our cards. I feel like I lost this game to just the enhancements on your cards. Yeah. Uh, Kronos can't play that. For Kronos, I'll play like Eclectic Inquiry. And that's it. Okay. Six. I will say uh, this. I'm going to play Drekker and Lilithal. I'll red hot armor for one. Uh, she doesn't have any armor. Uh, but I do get to capture her. I'll capture her on Lilithal. And. Um, your turn. I will draw three. I'll say Star Lance. I'll reap with Hayden. Hayden just make it so much amber. Yeah. I'll red alert for one. <sighs> you gotta be kidding me. Subject Kirby. It's two. The Genji. Alright. Uh, I had a pandemonium, which was oh, wow. um, okay. but the red the red alert for one yeah. uh, damages my guys. Uh, these do nothing. Yeah, you got it. Whew. We could steal on that Hayden man. Uh, the, it was the this was way more efficient the, than I thought it was. The stupid Forge compiler is so good. That card is actually insane. Yeah. I think that card is bonkers. Um, those like those nerd. I could have fought those. Like I could have done something about those nerds a thousand turns before, but you you boarded all of them. So. All right, new box, new box, who dis? Forge compiler is so good. All right. I'm gonna get this. One or two games from this box. I think you. I think in those two games you outdrew me by about fifty cards. Yeah, it was a lot. If I'm, if I'm the first like, one especially, because uh, of if the, I'm just guessing, yeah. it, it had to have been fifty cards. Uh, we have two boxes left exactly. Yeah, so as we are, right now, we are so. halfway through. Morius, the far-sighted temple explorer. Oh, I got another Niffle Kong. Wow, so many Niffle Kongs. G beat, webkeeper of the Clean Valley. G beat. 
and then I got a Bumblebird. Oh, good. Can I live the dream? <laughs> the Bumblebirded Nufflecop? Can I live the dream? Yeah, two boxes per person left. So four total boxes. Next I'll follow Bert Magoot. <laughs> Uh, I think I had one deck with Dark Amber Vault, but I didn't get to see it played. We do have 100 decks, yep. So we're, we've opened 52 decks now. This is, I guess this is our 54th. 53rd and 54th. How difficult do you find it to play the two card creatures? Not at all. They've uh, they've fine. come into play in every deck that we've had them in. Yeah, they're fine. Yeah, they're great. Uh, they got a capture icon on Nifflape. Hmm. We've gotten three Niffle Kongs and it, two Dinos. It's coming does a lot of work. Yeah, it does. They probably played tested for a while without that, and they're like, we need something. Yeah. I've got a new frontier, so I can maybe hit. Uh, I can like say untamed to try to hit it. Ooh, two Garcias! I like that. I like what I see you there. Mm -hmm. That's what they said. Yeah. Okay. I have the dreaded Shadow Council. Oh God. Johnny Longfingers? What's that? Each friendly mutant gains destroyed steel one. Oh, God. Johnny Longfingers is so creepy. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on over here, <laughs> fella? Ooh, Howling Pit. I haven't seen that in a hot minute. Oh. Oh. Rad Penny. God. Rad Penny. I can already. I'm just getting mad thinking about Rad Pennies. Mm <laughs> hmm. Red Penny and Johnny Longfingers. Mm. She comes into play, steals one. It is just pretty good. Steals one. Yeah. That bubble bird, though. <laughs> yeah, Johnny. Why are your fingers so long, Johnny? <laughs> hey, Johnny, why the long fingers? Is that the delivery? Why the long fingers? And Secret Needle? Oh my god. Yeah, Secret Needle's in there. That's really dumb. Subtle Auto. I can like play Subtle Auto, shoot him. Jeez. Jeez. And he's a mutant? Yeah. Subtle oh Auto's god. That's very dumb. G-Beep. Morius, the far-sighted Temple Explorer. G-Beep. Web Keeper of the Clean Valley. <laughs> Keeps those webs, man. <laughs> Far sighted temple explorer. It's back. What's up, dude? He's stretching. You gotta go look in. Hold up. You gotta climb into the chair. <laughs> <laughs> You're getting licked. How'd you do? Yeah. <laughs> okay. You need some chest scratching sets? What's up? What's up? Yeah, you get a treat. It's definitely playtime. I'll give you a treat though. Good job. Oh, it's your face. Oh, you knocked off the reference card. His tail tried to take out the camera. We knocked out. The what card? Uh, with the the Marvel card oh. or whatever on there on the the card cam. <laughs> hey. I'm back. I'm back. It says <laughs> it was up. Oh. Oh. <sighs> I 
I can't shuffle if you scratch my arm. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Why is my camera blurry? What has happened? You can't there focus on the dog. Yeah, too much dog. Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Hey. Where'd you get all this energy? Did you shot? Did you cut? I did. <laughs> <laughs> you got it. All right. Seven. No take, only throw. <laughs> also seven. Six. A five. This is the mulligan. That's it. That's all I needed. I'm back to sleep. That's all the energy he could muster. That's one treat's worth of energy. Mm, I guess this is fine. Well, maybe. It's, yeah, it's fine. All right, got it. Say sorry in. Let's exile. I'm gonna say Star Alliance. I'm gonna play New Frontiers. Uh, I'm gonna say Untamed. Okay. Pretty good. I will play an Explorer Rover. I'm gonna give it an Observe You Max. I will discard Hadron Collision. And it is your turn. Say so Saurian. I'll play Saurian Egg, House the Great, and then Defense Initiative to award the Saurian Egg. Did you want to exalt anybody with that? I am going to say Shadows. I'm going to play the Shadow Council. I'm going to play Subtle Auto and discard a card from your hand. Real subtle. Real freaking subtle. 15, 15 years. 15 years. Look at that. 1.5 years. Okay. 15 <laughs> years. 18 months. That's awesome, though. Thank you so much, Bill. Uh, seek your needle. Appreciate it, Bill. Uh, I am going to mug um, the sorry nug. I wanted to make two things with it. You're going to make two things with it anyway, because you're unreasonably lucky with that card. That's true. And your turn. I will draw. Say logos. Um, use the egg. Ludo. Oh, okay. The Ludo is pretty good. Is yeah. it ready? It is ready. And he's powerful. Too much power. Play daughter Smoko Demo Bot. Power, yeah, eight power Ludo is pretty, pretty big. Okay, I am going to say Star Alliance. Okay. I am going to play Armory Officer Nell. I'm gonna play Sensor Chief Garcia. I'm gonna play a detention coil on the demo bot. Well, you can't fight with it on command, basically, and get a 
like the destroyed stuff. I haven't even seen that. Um, That's the first one of those we've seen, right? Yeah, it is uncommon. Mm -hmm. So, uh, upgrade cards in your play. So I draw. Um, Spoiler Rover. I guess just reaps. I'll capture one. And I will tell you to go ahead. He's back. Ah. Ah. He's unhinged. He's pretty unhinged. He's unhinged and deranged. All right, I'll say sorry, Ian. <laughs> Give me your hand. Uh, <laughs> I will play no, it, it, we, Curse we, we, of we Vanity. We all love this dog. I'll Have put one on Faust and one on Shadow Council. Play Sagittarius Gaze to exalt a damaged creature. There's none. I'll play. I heard it's been very middling. Yeah, I'll fight, fight the Shadow Council. Yep. I will play Spoil the Battle. Another creature captures one. And capture. And I'll play High Priest Torvus. Your turn. I think Eddie has decided this is our last game. Yeah. He's... Why are you sniffing those decks? <laughs> Why are you sniffing around? Why are you walking under the table oh, with all the cords? Fine. He made it. Okay. The uh, Explorer River captures off spoils? Did it capture? Yeah, it would capture off your spoils. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Each creature okay. that has one on yep. it. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to say Untamed. I'm going to discard this Reclaimed by Nature, because unfortunately it would, it would, uh, I would put Marikas in. It would um, purge my Secret Needle. Plan Niffle Kong. Out it comes. <laughs> okay. Um, search my deck for Niffles. Niffle. 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 Niffles in the discard pile. Bastard to lose? Yeah, uh, Justin's had two Ambassador to lose. It's pretty cool, but I don't think Justin got to activate him at all. No. So. Out come the Niffles. Uh, I'll play Niffle Ape. Capture one on Niffle Kong. I'll play two more Niffle Apes. Uh, I will play a Fandangle. And it is your turn. And we'll draw three. Clear sleeves are nice, yeah. Um, yep. I'll say shadows. I'll look over there, the fan dangle. Not work. I'll look over there, the armory officer. Then I'll play dark wave. I'll discard button anything. I'll play Vandalize. These guys. Discard that. Your turn. Okay, I am going to say Untamed. 
<laughs> it's time. Yeah, finally. It's finally time, Nuffle King. Um, a Fandangle is gonna reap. Now I got, I got two. I got two giant creature decks. Nathan just got the one that has both of them, in, which is sweet. I'll reap with Niffle Ape. I'll reap with Niffle Ape. I will play Cephalist. Um, Niffle Kong's gonna fight Prefectus Ludo. X six. I will destroy a Niffle creature. Destroy a friendly Niffle creature. If I do, I deal three damage to a creature, so I'll kill the Smoko. Um, I steal one and I destroy an enemy artifact, of which you have none. <laughs> he, he, he went and got his rope. He went and got his rope. There, now it's easy to Actually, no, I can't. In my other chair, I could just like jam it right there and he just pulls it, on it. Yeah. I'm just like ignoring it. <laughs> um, this Niffle Ape, I think, just reaps. It does seem kind of dangerous to let you keep Hyper Restorvis in play, but I don't, and there's not really much I can do about it. So uh, I will say check with eight, and it is your turn. Hey. I'll draw one. Logos, pick an archive. All effervescent. Play two Mobius scrolls. <laughs> Play a Howling Pit. Reap with the Demo Bot. Actually, I think I want to discard one of these actually. So I'll discard that. Another discard this card. I'll play. Standardized testing. Just get the Kong and the a subtle auto. Oh, opposition research. Yep, can't reap next turn. Can't reap. And play Kixo. Draw six. All right, I will say Shadows. I am going to play Johnny Longfingers, who comes in to play Ready. It's a Fandangle, somehow it's alive. Um, I am going to play Opportunist on Garcia. Should capture one. Um, I'm going to tempting offer Kyo, I guess. Okay, one. And then Johnny Longfingers is going to fight Torvus. He'll destroy Steel. I want to get more value out of him, but uh, it's not looking like there. So, all right, I'll say check with seven. It's your turn. I will draw to seven. Okay. Say Logos. Standardized testing. The GOAT. Standardized testing. Okay. I'll steal one. You won't steal because I have Cephalist. 
Oh. Play that. Will be a scroll. Please. Sure. Okay. So I will forge for six. I will say um, Star Alliance. I'm going to access deny on Keo. I'm just going to draw me a card. Jeez. <laughs> Oh man, that's super good. Uh, I will Quintrino Flux for three. I'll play Garcia to make you forge for eight. And it is your turn. I'll draw. Say the shadows. Play safe house. Play Pincerator. Play the Asthma Bomb. And shoot the Garcia. Francis and shoot the Garcia. MG, I'll have another one. I'll play Red Paint. She dies to the Pinsir Raider at the end. Oh, yeah. And then this gets shot, and Red Paint gets shot. Then. Draw these. That's it. Pinsir Raider does, at the end of each turn, does one to each blank creature. I am going to say Untamed. I'm going to play Bumblebird. I will play Cephalist. I am going to Reclaim by Nature. And... Oh, I was supposed to draw one more in the last turn because of Howling Pit. Um, I am going to Reclaim to by Nature. Pincer Raider. Okay. Get one. I will play It's Coming, but uh, I'm just going to discard it because okay. uh, I'll play It's Coming. I'll put that in my hand. I can do get a look at my deck. Okay. I'll discard that. Um, all right, man, it's your turn. I will draw, then shuffle, and draw three more. Believe it did. Got the one for. I only had two amber pips in my hand, and then I got the one for the pincer raider. Yeah. Uh, I'll say Orion, archive. Play city gates and shoot the one bird. How dare you! <laughs> How dare you! All axiom. Kill that guy. Word from Gamgee. I'll play. Francis is dead. I'll discard this Axiom. Play Ludo. Play Corvus. Francis is dead. The Axiom. Oh, yeah. And that is it. Okay, I am going to say Shadows. I'm going to Dark Wave. I am going to Rad Penny. She was the last card in my deck, um, which is pretty unforch. I'll play Mesa's Asp. I'll play a Fidget. I'll Secret Needle the Rad Penny. Finally, I get to do this. Yep, feels good. And it's your turn. I'll say check with seven. The shadows. Double dark wave. Obliterate my stupid dinosaurs. You don't want to be fidgeting? Uh, not really. I could safe house one. Yeah, I'll safe house uh, Ludo. Safe house is a really good card. Yeah. I will play Rad Penny. Oh, miasma bomb, and that is it. 
Drop chain, draw three. Okay, I will say untamed. I'm gonna play Cephalist. Fandangle, I'll play It's Coming. Question is, do I discard Mr. Kong here? Problem is, my hand is like bad for Niffle Kong. Mm. I do. Um, I guess I do draw two. Nah, I'm just gonna pitch it. Yeah. I'm gonna pitch it. We'll get you in trouble. Say so check with seven, and it is your turn of all three. Okay, I'll say Logos. Well, I, I, I ripped it. Oh, Immediately man. Immediately ripped it. Jeez, that's extra bad. I'll say, I'll play Titan Engineer, Daughter, Opposition Research, Demo Bot, Mobius Scroll, Research, Smoko. Before for seven. seven. Yeah. Okay. Update. Okay, gonna say Star Alliance. I am going to uh, Quintrina flex my Fandangle and Daughter. I am going to access deny this Titan Engineer. I am going to detention coil rad penny. I am going to play and observe you backs and wonder where my Nell is. <laughs> and it's your turn. I'll draw off. Good. Say sorry. Archive. Play Ludo, play Faust, play Sagittarius' Gaze. All Curse of Vanity. Spoils of Battle. You get that. Oh, I gotta capture one first, right? Mm, yeah. Then capture that. Then I'll defense initiative that, and I will exalt to more buds. And city gates. Oh, yeah. That's it. Okay. I am going to say Star Alliance again. I will New Frontiers. I will say uh, Shadows. <sighs> okay. I will play Garcia. I will play Commander Chan. And it's your turn. I'll draw. Man. I, f I feel like I should win the crap out of this game if I didn't draw things in like the slight, a slightly wrong order. Mm -hmm. I'll say sorry and fight Cephalist. I'll fight Chain or Garcia. I'll play a sorry and egg. City gates. And that's it. Okay. I am gonna say shadows. I'm gonna play Shadow Council. I'm gonna mug. Um, Ludo. I will play Subtle Auto and discard a card from your hand. It's a. Uh, I think New Frontiers is. Okay, each card of the chosen. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So Opportunist would be. Um, 
here in okay. my hand or archives i would yeah. put it in my hand yeah, yeah i thought it was just creatures so good call arc effervescent i am going to put opportunist on commander chan and we'll capture one um seeker needle do i want to shoot my own subtle auto it's kind of it's a big ask um, because it turns off my Shadow Council. What are the chances I could use my Shadow Council anyway? Uh, sure, I'll Seeker Needle my Subtle Auto. Alright, your turn, I will draw three. You forge for seven. Say logos. I will use the yeah. Saurian. Well, uh, yeah, exactly. A standardized testing. That's sixes and ones. I'll standardize testing for sixes and threes. Click yo. Use Mobius scroll. Does it? Shuffle. Okay. I am going to say Untamed, I will discard the other half of Niffle Kong. I'm going to reclaim by nature. I have two of these in this deck, by the way. I had drawn both before you got all your artifacts mm -hmm. shenanigans going on. Um, anyway, so I'll reclaim by nature. Um, I'll get the City Gates. I'll do a damage to uh, Ludo. It's purged. Um, I will play a bunch of Niffles. Uh, this Nuffle Ape is going to capture onto, I guess, Chan. It's the only one that's like even halfway safe. And it's your turn. I'll draw five. The shadows with Archive. Look over there, the commander chain. Play Seeker Needle. Play O Nithing. Let's go two. Play Red Penny. Play Gamgee. Play Vandalize. I, I, I did not I, get to I play got that this. with the first game. Yeah, <laughs> so I did not get to play this card this yeah, game. So. I'll safe house the Bo Nithing. Uh, your turn. Okay, I six. am going to say Shadows. I'm going to play Johnny Longfingers. I will play a Rad Penny of my own. Um, I'm going to Tempting Offer the Faust. Gain one. I will Seeker Needle my Rad Penny and steal one with Johnny Longfingers. And oh, gain one off the secret unit. And it's your turn. So I'll draw this, shuffle, and draw two. Okay, I'll switch out as and pick up archive. I'm going to reap with the GMG. Illuminizing. Reap with Rad Penny. Needle the Rad Penny. Safe House the Bonite. Safe House the Bonite, man. It's a pretty good late game. It's like, what if I Ronnie Wrist Clocks every turn? Yep. Oh, 
Man. Mm. You got it. Dang. Because I can steal two from you, but yeah. Bow knifing. Oh, God. I needed... Yeah, I... I didn't see that bow knifing until just then, right? Um, yeah, because I just... Because I would have I would have probably purged the safe house instead of the city gates. Yeah. That was a point mistake. Because I was like, rad painty, whatever, you're going to shoot her and she's going to go back to the deck anyway, so... There's no reason to get rid of this. Uh, if I had seen the bow knifing, I think I would have purged the safe house because that yeah. that like is like that's, that's like so a unusual. perfect thing yeah. that you want at the end of the game, right? Because you just get to you just get to yeah, stupid. Okay. So. That was a good game. It just sucked to lose it. it was. There was a lot of back and forth. Yeah, and very close. So what you like the end games. Okay, that's it for tonight. We're done. We'll be back tomorrow. For more, yeah. Still excited. We got a lot more decks yeah. to open. So thirty, sorry, twenty three decks left to go. Yeah, we're. Uh, I'm enjoying it. Yeah, a lot of cool I guess, stuff. I got some sweet. We got some sweet decks. Honestly, yeah, definitely a lot of cool stuff going on. Um, uh, I don't know if we're gonna start early tomorrow. We might. Um, it depends yeah. on how we feel. Yeah, it depends. I mean, I may have work stuff to do okay. tomorrow, as far as I know. Yeah. Um. So, but either way, we'll be okay. we'll be live at at least seven thirty normal yeah. time. Yeah. So yeah, we'll be back tomorrow. So, All right. Uh, everyone have a great night and yeah. uh, come see us tomorrow. Thanks for watching. We'll be back. Goodbye. See ya.